First National Bank and Trust has become Sovereign Bank and continues to be a proud supporter of the Mangum Tiger Athletics. At Sovereign Bank, supporting our schools and athletic programs is our top priority. We appreciate and support our community through and through. At First Sovereign Bank, you can hear us roar, Go Tigers! We wish you great success in your endeavors now and in the future. Sovereign Bank and Trust Company, your bank for life. Same great people, same location at 204 North Oklahoma Avenue in Man. Member FDIC, Equal Housing Lender. When you need auto repairs, save money and get it done right at Dwayne's Auto in Mangum. Dwayne's fixes flats, does brake jobs, turns rotors, alignments, that all-important air conditioning work, and general auto repair. If your car or truck isn't right, just head to Dwayne's Auto at 1205 North Lewis Tittle in Mangum. Call 782-5151. That's 782-5151. Mangum Tiger Proud. 333 Dental Care in Mangum is the dental practice of Dr. Dustin Lively. His experience, skill, and compassion go together when providing exceptional, up-to-date patient care. Dr. Lively and his team of professionals are proud to help you with the best dental care possible, along with preventive care that will result in a beautiful, long-lasting smile. Call 580-782-2552 or visit the team at 333 Dental Care. They support the Mangum Tigers and Lady Tigers. J&P's Cafe in Mangum offers great food made fresh with the best ingredients under the direction of Chef George is what you'll find at J&P Cafe in Mangum. If you haven't tried the best Mexican food and American favorites at J&P Cafe in Mangum, what are you waiting for? Open Tuesday through Sunday for lunch and dinner. Also breakfast served all day and homemade desserts, including pecan pie and wonderful assorted cheesecakes. For takeout, call 580-706-5042 at 706-5042 and like J&P Cafe on Facebook. Granite Drug Company would like to thank their customers for shopping local. They're proud to offer pharmacy services, including immunizations, dispill personalized medication management, health and beauty products, gifts for every occasion, and the soda fountain open all day and serving lunch from 11 till 2. Remember, when you need prescriptions filled, tell your doctor, Granite Drug Company. For top-notch heating and air conditioning service and installation, you can rely on paints, heating and air serving southwest oklahoma and north texas from their headquarters in mangum oklahoma with years of experience and hundreds of satisfied customers called pains heating and air conditioning at 799-5130 799-5130 people in mangum are really enjoying handcrafted espresso drinks from the soggy llama drive through wake up and get your caffeine infusion the way you like it starting at 5 30 in the morning on weekdays the Llama offers a variety of refreshing cold drinks, including Italian sodas and Red Bull infusions. They're ready to please and refresh and made your way. Like the Soggy Llama Coffee Company on Facebook, open seven days a week. We are a community of ongoing legacy and tradition. This is Jacob Gilner from Cattleman's Bank, member FDIC. We are so proud of the continued success of Mangum Tigers and Lady Tigers. On Cattleman's Bank is behind you all the way. TCLC is a family-owned five-star daycare center that has been caring for children for over 45 years. The owners of Tiger Cub are proud to serve the Mangum area and support the Mangum Lady Tigers and Tigers on the radio and streaming. TCLC says... Yeah! Hi, my name is Bailey Pence. I'm a proud graduate of Altus High School. When deciding where I would go to college, Western Oklahoma State College was at the top of my list. Going to Western was the best financial decision for me. At Western, I will get the opportunity to obtain my associate's degree while also competing on the shooting team. With over 20 degree programs and schedules that fit your needs, there is an option for everyone. Call 580-471-2000 or visit wsc.edu to get started today. Make Western your smart start. Ladies and gentlemen, Tiger's Den serving those famous onion burgers and the hot sauce you all love. Ashley Hill is your host, along with Ruthie on the grill. Dine Monday through Saturday, 7 a.m. to 2 p.m. and 5 to 8 p.m. for fish, steaks, burgers, and pie. And don't forget the Sunday special. Tiger's Den, open and serving you on North Lewis Tittle in Mangum. Dine in or carry out. Right, and again, 
Thursday morning to you, Chad Fox with the Mangum Lady Tigers. We are in Oklahoma City on this Thursday. Uh, Hall of Fame Festival taking place. Teams from across the state, across classifications, set to play a couple of games uh, today. The Mangum Lady Tigers will kick things off with a game against Perkins Tryon. And... We'll get you the uh, starting lineups. It's set to start here in just a few moments. Looks like we're going to have the national anthem, so we'll take a, a timeout and get you set for Mangum Lady Tigers softball. We are live on the air. Classic Hits 97.7 Facebook and Mangum Tiger TV on YouTube and also OKSports.TV OK back after this. Blair Tire and Feed on the corner of Highway 283 and 19 is your certified Firestone Tire dealer and also a proud supporter of the Mangum Tigers and Lady Tigers. When you need tires, we're specialty trained and equipped to take care of you. Lyle Shaw and his crew at Blair Tire and Feed wish the Tigers lots of luck in today's game and always remember play smart play safe play hard and play with pride and good luck from everyone at Blair Tire and Feed on the corner of Highway 283 and 19 in Blair Oklahoma it's new Western Traditions is a unique furniture store with a cowboy flair located on the square in downtown Mangum this new store features high-end one-of-a-kind Western furniture accessories art and collectibles Western Traditions is truly unique and loaded wall-to-wall -wall with Western gift-giving choices. Stop in and meet the owner, Lloyd Burgess. Western Traditions is open weekdays 9 to 5, Saturday 9 till noon, closed Sunday. Visit Western Traditions on the west side of the square, Mangum, Oklahoma. Folks in Mangum know what to do when they need to quench a thirst, curb a hunger attack, or cool down with an ice cream. They just make the loop. At 918 North Lewis Tidland, Mangum, the Loop, supporting the Mangum Tigers and Lady Tigers. Something you should know about the Kendall Law Office. The Kendall Law Office is family owned and local. They use up to date technology to ensure their productivity provides timely service to clients. And this always includes client access to our firm via email and text. Corey Kendall is experienced, hardworking, and honest. He always puts the client first, and all efforts are focused on the client's best interest. The Kendall Law Office. Locations in Altus and Mangum. Friends, it's important to take care of your eyes, so make an appointment soon with Dr. Michael Geiger in Altus, Seth Geiger in Frederick, and Bryce Geiger in Elgin, and a new addition to our staff, Dr. Maddie Rhodes. The Geigers are professionals and very good at what they do. Geiger Eye Care is proud to support youth and sponsor sporting events. They encourage you to attend all the events you can and be involved with our youth. Geiger Eye Care, Michael and Maddie in Altus, Seth and Frederick, and Bryce in Elgin. Make an appointment soon with Geiger Eye Care, Altus, Frederick, and and Elgin. Greer County Farm Bureau agents Mickey Lively and Rod Calhoun support high school sports. Mickey and Rod offer insurance for property, auto, casualty, life, commercial, and crop insurance. They're ready to serve you at 231 North Oklahoma in Mangum. Call 580-782-3827. All right, welcome back to Oklahoma City. We are at the Hall of Fame uh, complex uh, here at, uh, in Oklahoma City, right next to Remington Park across the street from the Oklahoma City Zoo. And we are on field n number four. It is called, it's sponsored by Integris, so it's now called the Integris Field. And we are underway here. It is the Mangum Lady Tigers and Perkins Tryon Lady Demons. And up first is Brand Woodris for Coach Bingham and the Lady Tigers. She's going to hit it into left field for a leadoff single, and we're underway. In slow pitch here in the spring. Fast pitch in the fall. So Lady Tigers have got something going here. Leadoff single in the uh, top of the first. And let's get you the... Lineup here. Holly Lehman Webb will bat second. Uh, Maddie Paxton will bat third. And the first pitch to Holly is in there for a called strike. And uh, it is 0 and 1. Lehman Webb, ground ball, third baseman will go to second. And there's one away as Woodruff retired at second. Lehman Webb on board with the fielder's choice.
excuse me, that that's uh, Lehman Webb at the plate now for the Lady Tigers. Just a slight change in the lineup here. That was Landry Lively that grounded out to third, or grounded to third. Landry is aboard at first base. And a cold strike on Lehman Webb. A little bit of a lineup change. So Woodruff, Lively, and Lehman Webb here. One, two, three in the top of the first. Here's the pitch to Holly. Ground ball right to the shortstop. Could be a double play. They go to second. The throw over to first. Not quite in time. Landry is out at second. Lehman Webb safe at first with two away. And that brings up Maddie Paxton. Woodruff, Lively, Lehman Webb, Paxton White, Zachary, Hammond, Taylor, Stair, and Stu uh, Stuchel uh, for the Lady Tigers. And the pitcher for Perkins Tryon is Taylor Stanley. First pitch to Maddie is a ball. Two away. Top of the first. Here is the 1 0 pitch. Hit it into center field. Center fielder is there. It makes the catch for out number three. No runs, one hit, no errors, and a runner left on here in the top of the first for Manga. We go to the bottom of inning number one. Perkins Tryon is up to bat whenever we come back. Lady Tiger, softball, classic hits, 97.7. We may be small town, but we have big dreams. This is Lori Laughlin from Cattlemen's Bank, member FDIC, and we are proud supporters of the Mangum Tigers and Lady Tigers. To all the athletes this season, give it your very best because Cattlemen's Bank is cheering loud and proud, and we're behind you all the way. Mangum Brick Company has been operating since the early 1900s. They're the largest private employer in Greer County. Mangum Brick is proud to support high school athletics radio broadcasts. And if you know of someone looking for work, always check with Mangum Brick as they may be hiring. Triad Home Health in Mangum is locally owned and offers nursing, physical therapy, occupational, wound care, IV therapy, and more. All administered by people who go above and beyond for you. Phone Triad Home Health today at 580 580- 782-5800. That's 782-5800. All right, back here in Oklahoma City with Lady Tigers. Uh, Chad here. Mangum taking on Perkins Tryon. Lady Demons, a 5A team. Mangum, a 3A team. And the lineup for Perkins goes like this. Batting leadoff will be center fielder Addie Brown. Batting second. First baseman Chesney Lowry batting third will be Rover Matty uh, Castle batting fourth. Pitcher Taylor Stanley batting fifth. Shortstop Landry Shepard batting sixth. Hannah Wolf batting seventh. Jaden Cox batting eighth. Maya Wolf batting ninth. Ellie Terrell and Jordan Cox rounds out the uh, lineup for. Perkins try on again Lady Demons Perkins in the home whites black numerals black and white helmets and the black and white stirrups Mangum in the traveling all black uniforms here today white numerals and orange trim pitching for Mangum Julie Stuchel for for coach Bingham in the Lady Tigers behind the plate is Taylor, and the first pitch is a called strike. Second one's outside for a ball. 1-1 one, one count to Addie Brown. Again, Brown, Lowry, and Castle for the Lady Demons. We'll, we will be playing Woodward at four on the main field here at Hall of Fame Stadium. That's hit to left field. Left fielder is there. It makes the catch. What a catch in left by Holly. Lehman Webb going to her left, falls down, but makes the catch. That was going to one-hop the wall. So an excellent catch 
in left by Lehman Webb. And there is one away. That brings up uh, Chesney Lowry from the left side for Perkins Tryon. And the first pitch is a called strike, and it's 0-1. Emmy Smith and Mike Brown, the coaches for Perkins. Coach Brian Bingham for the Mangum Lady Tigers here today. That one's inside, and it's one and one to Lowry. Again, Mangum faking, uh, facing a Perkins try on here today at 10, and then it, they'll take on Woodward at 4 at 4 o'clock this afternoon. Here's the 1-1. One, one. That's hit high and deep into right center field for a solo shot. So, solo home run for Chesney Lowry. And she'll cross home plate and make it 1-0 Perkins. Here in the bottom of the first. Brings up. Matty Castle for the Lady Demons. Here's the pitch. Short for a ball. 1-0 count. 1-0 Perkins. Bottom of inning number one. First game of the day. We're on the field number four facing Southwest. That's inside ball two. You can, staring at the Oklahoma City Zoo in the downtown skyscrapers that one's a ball so a 3-0 count in the pitch ball four so a one out walk by Castle and that brings up Taylor Stanley for Perkins. Castle at first base. Here's the pitch with one away. Ball one. One nothing. Solo home run by Chesney Lowry. Here's pitch. Ball two. On deck is Landry Shepard. for the Lady Demons. Again, Lady Tigers in the all-black here today in the outfield. They, they are the visiting team in this game. Here's the pitch. Called strike, and it's two and one. Two one. Ground ball, and it's gonna get past Brand into the outfield. So Perkins has got runners at first and second with one away. Then brings up Landry Shepard, the shortstop for Perkins. First pitch is a strike. to Shepard. Bottom of inning number one. What nothing lead here on the solo home run by Perkins. Ground ball. Woodruff gets it. Steps on second. Throws to first. Not in time. There's two away. And runners will be at the corners for Hannah Wolf. One nothing lead. Here is the pitch. Ball one. Magnum Lady Tigers, Perkins Tryon, Lady Demons. 3A Magnum, 5A Perkins. Here's the pitch. Inside ball two. Runners at first and third. There are two away. Magnum looking for that third out here. Here's the pitch. Ball three. Oh, 
Jalen Cox is on deck. Here's the pitch. Ball four. So the bases are loaded with two away in the bottom of the first. And Cox will step in for Perkins Tryon. Here's the pitch. Hit into left field. Lively is there. And it is a grand slam. Grand slam. Landry backed up to the wall and it cleared it. So that makes it 5 nothing On a grand slam. From Jalen Cox. Brings up Maya Wolf. Catcher. For Perkins. So we've got a. We've had a solo home run by Lowry. And a grand slam by Cox. And that makes it 5 nothing. Perkins here in the bottom of the first. Called strike. Second pitch is a called strike, and it's 0-2 to Maya Wolf. And the pitch. Inside, ball one. One, two count. And the pitch. Inside, ball two. So deuces across the board, 2-2 two -two count, two-way. Five runs have come across for Perkins here in the first. Ball three. So Maya Wolf has worked, worked an 0-2 count to 3-2. Base is cleared, two-way. Here's the pitch. Foul tip, strike three. And that is out number three. But Perkins Tryon does some damage. Solo home run by Chesney Lowry. And a grand slam by Jalen Cox. We go to the top of inning number two. Mangum will be up to bat, trailing 5 nothing to Perkins Tryon. We are in Oklahoma City with the Mangum Lady Tigers. On Classic Hits, 97.7. Hi, I'm Anna at Dapper 14 Boutique in Mangum. Are you looking for new clothes and accessories that are on trend, flattering, and comfy? Dapper 14 is just the place. We carry sizes small through 3X. Stop by 209 North Oklahoma in Mangum. Find us on Facebook or Instagram, or visit the website at dapyr14.com. We appreciate our customers, we love our community, and we always root for the Tigers. At Great Plains Bank in Mangum, their customers come first and have for over 100 years. Great Plains Bank in Mangum provides personalized solutions and outstanding customer service that meets the needs of every customer, no matter how big or small. Great Plains Bank believes that banking is a relationship, not just a transaction. So they treat their customers like family. At Great Plains Bank, they live and work in the communities they serve. Great Plains Bank of Mangum, Oklahoma. When it comes to funeral homes, there are several to choose from. But choosing a funeral home that is locally owned offers the advantage of the local owners who are involved right here in the community, helping you during your time of need. Greer Funeral Home owners Carson and Stacy Van Zant are perfect examples of owners who offer that family-like connection that you'd expect from a friend and a neighbor. Greer Funeral Home in Mangum and Granite, providing dignity and respect. Morgan White hits it to third base on a 1-0 count and is gunned down at first. So there is one away here in the top of inning number two. So we had five, six, and seven in the order for the Mangum Lady Tigers here in the second. White retired at first. Here's Hadley Zachary. First pitch to her is a called strike. 
5-0 Perkins tryout on top of the Mangum Lady Tigers here in top of the second. Ground ball in the hole, left field base hit. Good job by Hadley. One out single. Brings up Hammond. Right fielder. Here's pitch. Base hit, left field. Back-to-back -back hits for Mangum. Here in the top of the second. Again, slow pitch. Don't worry about the score. You just you keep taking your hacks. And you could score a bunch in a hurry. Brings up Taylor for the Lady Tigers. One away, runners at first and second for Mangum. And a nice oppo hit into right field. Zachary will go to third. The bases will be loaded with one away for Hannah Stair. Great hit by Taylor into right. So the bases are loaded with one out. And Hannah Stair, second baseman, will step in. We might get a courtesy running, runner for Zachary, but the discussion was over. Not sure what it was about. Everybody stays put. Bases loaded, one away for Hannah. First pitch to stairs, a called strike. Trying to get on the board here in the top of the second. Mangum trailing 5 nothing to Perkins try on Lady Demons. Here's the 0-1. Hit into right center. It's going to be caught. Zachary will hustle back to third, and there's two away and a nice grab by the Rover. That would be Landry Shepard. So two away. Lady Tigers got the bases loaded. First pitch is a strike to Stuchel. Woodruff's top of the order on deck. There's a foul ball. It's 0-2 to Stuchel. Bases are loaded. Two away from Mangum trying to get on the board here in the top of the second, trailing 5-0 to Perkins. Again, a 5-8 team. Mangum a 3-8 team. Here's the pitch. Ground ball. Shortstop is there. Flips over to second, and Lady Demons get out of it. Lady Tigers leave the bases loaded here on the top of the second. Cannot get a run across. We go to the bottom of inning number two. Five nothing. Perkins try on on top of the Mangum Lady Tigers. Classic hits, ninety seven point seven. Hi, Mangum Tiger fans. This is Jill Grauman with Remax Property Place. If you need to buy or sell a property or a home in Mangum or anywhere in Greer County, just call me at five eight zero seven zero six zero two five nine. You'll see lots of my signs around town because I get the results for my clients. I say, go Mangum Tigers. Jill Grauman, Remax Property Place. Always here, always helping. The Mangum Tag Agency is easy to find at 108 East Pierce Street in Mangum. When you need license tags, registration, driver's license renewal, pipe passes, or real ID, Tom and Cynthia Clark are there for you. And they can help you at the Mangum Tag Agency at 580-782-3004. 782 -3004. Ashley Slayton, family nurse practitioner, and the rest of the friendly faces at the JCMH Family Care Clinic in Mangum treat all ages, children through adults. This means we are all yours for well child exams, annual checkups, as well as those illnesses that can hit us. We also do management of chronic illnesses like asthma, diabetes, and high blood pressure. Same day appointments are usually available. The JCMH Family Care Clinic is located at 114 South Lewis Tittle in Mangum. Call 782-3393 for appointments. 
All right, back here in Oklahoma City. First pitch is a strike from Stuchel. That's going to be hit in the air. It's caught by Hannah Stare. Had a ton of spin on it. It came up quickly and made that nice play on the run. So there's one away. And that was Ellie uh, Terrell. Nine, one, uh, ten, and one in the order here for Perkins Tryon. Perkins leads 5 nothing over the Mangum Lady Tigers. So Jordan Cox at the plate. And that is a strike. So a 1 1 count to Jordan Cox. Addie Brown is on deck. One one pitch, slow roller, and Maddie's going to get it, and there's not going to be a throw. Infield hit for Jordan Cox. Swung at it hard, but it just barely nicked the bat, and it just worked as a bunt. Maddie was deep. So, one out hit for Perkins. Top of the order, Addie Brown at the plate with a runner at first. Inside for a ball. Five nothing lead for Perkins Tryon. And the allergies have just hit. My goodness. It's a gorgeous day. There is no wind. We're on field number four facing southwest. Here's the pitch. Hit in the air, and it's going to drop for a base hit. Hung up there forever. Morgan White could not get in to get it. And uh, a one-out single back-to-back -back hits for the Lady Demons. And they've got runners at first and second with one away. And that brings up Chesney Lowry, who hit a solo home run in the bottom of the first. Lowry, solo shot, got Perkins on the board. They followed it up with a grand slam. Too deep, ball two. A 1 1 count, excuse me. That's in there for a called strike. So where's the count? Blue, my goodness. Here is the pitch. It is fouled off, so that was strike two. All right, so 2-2. Two, two. We got it from the umpire. 2-2, two, two, one away, runners at first and second. Bottom of the second inning, and Perkins trying to add to their 5 nothing lead. That's drilled into left field. Morgan White catches it. Runner tags it second. The throw is... Not going to be in time. Woodruff throws over to Zachary, goes to the wall, so a run will come in. And that does not make Coach Bingham very happy. Two away. It's 6 nothing Perkins. And the pitch. Short, Matty Castle at the plate. Three hole, two outs, runner at second. A run has come across, here's the pitch. That's hit a mile high into left field. Lehman Webb is there and can't catch it. It is short of the wall. One more run will come in. And uh, RBI double for Matty Castle. Pop fly pushed Holly all the way to the wall. She had her hand on it, and it she just missed it, but it stayed in play. So it turned out to be a double and an RBI. Looked like a called strike to me. 
a one count. Hit into center field, and it's going to be dropped. And another run will come in, and Landry can't quite hang on to it. She was positioned more to the left or to her right, and there was a big gap in dead center field, and that's right where it was hit. Morgan White is shading over to the right field, Landry over to the left field. Makes it 8 nothing. Pitches a called strike to Landry Shepard. Runner at second base, still two away. Called strike 0-2. 0-2 count, two away. Runner at second base. Here is the pitch from Stuchel. Hit right to Woodruff off the hop. Can't handle it. Runner's going to be safe at first, and the runner stays put at second. So, runner for Runners at first and second, still two away. Here's the pitch. Too deep for a ball. One oh pitch inside for ball two. Runners at first and second, two away. Three runs have come in here in the bottom of the second for Perkins called strike, and it's two and one. And the pitch. The middle slowly going to be caught by Woodruff and she steps on second base after it hops one time for out number three. But Perkins adds three runs in the second, top of the third coming up. It is eight nothing. Mangum up to bat whenever we come back here on Classic Hits 97.7. Mangum Golden Age Apartments offer HUD-approved housing for anyone 62 or older or on Social Security disability. They have one bedroom and efficiencies which include all bills paid, including Wi-Fi. Mangum Golden Age Apartments are located at 100 East Lincoln right on the downtown square in Mangum. Call 580-782-2452 for more information. When unexpected illness or injury disrupts your day, immediate care is a necessity, not a luxury. At Variety Care's Hobart Clinic, we're here for you at the moment you need us most. Whether you are battling the flu, managing a chronic condition, or simply due for your annual checkup, our team of dedicated health care professionals is here to support you and your family with personalized care. Sooner care and private insurance plans accepted. Visit today, 1000 South Broadway, Hobart, 405-632-6688 to schedule an appointment. That's 405-632-6688. All right, back here in Oklahoma City, uh, Chad Fox with Coach Bingham and the Lady Tigers on field number four of Hall of Fame Stadium, Hall of Fame Complex. Is it USA Softball Complex? Is that the official name? We are facing north, excuse me, southwest. Mangum trailing 8 0 to Perkins Tryon. 1 2 3 in the order for the Mangum Lady Tigers here in the top of the third. First pitch to Bryn Woodruff is a called strike, and it's 0 and 1. Bryn hits it in the right center field. Rover there makes the play. And there's one away. And Rover is in shallow right center, and she is. Fast, and so she is covering a lot of green out there, doing a good job for Perkins. Brings up Landry Lively with one out, bases cleared. Called strike. Oh, and one. Here's the pitch. Fouled back, almost caught by the catcher. It'll be 0 2 to Landry. 
8-0 Perkins try on Lady Demons on top of the Mangum Lady Tigers. We are in the top of the third. One away. Pitch to Landry. Ground ball. Shortstop can't handle it. Goes into left field. And Landry is aboard on a hard hit ball. Basically off the shortstop into left field. Brings up Holly Lehman Webb for the Mangum Lady Tigers. One out, runner at first. In the pitch, outside for a ball. Taylor Stanley again, the pitcher for Perkins. And the 1 0 pitch to Lehman Webb. Is a called strike, and it's one on one to Holly. And the one one from Stanley is a ball. Two one count. Landry is at first with one out. Here is the pitch. Ball two, ball three, excuse me, three one count to Holly. Maddie Paxton is on deck. 8 nothing lead here for Perkins in the top of the third. Here's the pitch. Ball four. So one out walk. Given up by Stanley. Runners at first and second for Maddie Paxton. And Perkins try on a 5A team. Don't have the best record 7-6, and six, but they're ranked number 11 in class 5A. Called strike to Paxton. Lady Tigers left the bases loaded in the top of the second. Ground ball right to the shortstop. Float shores throws over to second. The throw to first gets by the first baseman. A run will come in. Mangum's on the board. Two away. Makes it 8-1. Lively scores. All the way from second. Paxton is aboard at first. Lehman Webb out at second. Two outs. Pitch. Morgan White, ground ball, caught by the third baseman, throws across the diamond out, number three. Mangum does get a run in the top of the third. Bottom of three coming up. Perkins try on leading the Mangum Lady Tigers. Eight to one. We are in Oklahoma City with the Mangum Lady Tigers. Classic hits, 97.7. First National Bank and Trust has become Sovereign Bank and continues to be a proud supporter of the Mangum Tiger Athletics. At Sovereign Bank, supporting our schools and athletic programs is our top priority. We appreciate and support our community through and through. At First Sovereign Bank, you can hear us roar, Go Tigers! We wish you great success in your endeavors now and in the future. Sovereign Bank and Trust Company, your bank for life. Same great people, same location at 204 North Oklahoma Avenue in Mangum. Member FDIC, Equal Housing Lender. When you need auto repairs, save money and get it done right at Dwayne's Auto in Mangum. Dwayne's fixes flats, does brake jobs, turns rotors, alignments, that all-important air conditioning work, and general auto repair. If your car or truck isn't right, just head to Dwayne's Auto at 1205 North Lewis Tidlin, Mangum. Call 782-5151. That's 782-5151. Mangum Tiger Proud. Mangum Lady Tigers, Perkins try on Lady Demons. We go to the bottom of the third. Perkins leading eight to one. Lady Tigers get a run in the top of the third. Stuchel pitching for the Mangum Lady Tigers. Here's the pitch. Fouled back for a strike. We've got seven, eight, and nine in the order for the Perkins try on Lady Demons. That's Jalen Cox at the plate in the 01. Outside for ball one.
So a 1-1 one, one count. Here's the pitch. Ground ball. Woodruff can't get to it. Base hit up the middle to lead things off from Jalen Cox. And that brings up Maya Wolf. So Wolf will step in with nobody out. Runner at first for Perkins. Ball one. Again, Mangan will take on Woodward at 5 o'clock on the big field, on the main field. That's at 4. Inside ball two. And we'll be here for that. So another Mangan Lady Tiger game this afternoon at 4 o'clock. Ball three. We'll catch up with the Mangum Tigers tomorrow. They are playing in the uh, Hobart tournament starting today. Outside ball four. So runner, runners at first and second with nobody out. Brings up Ellie Terrell for Perkins Tryon. So we'll have some baseball for you tomorrow. And hopefully Saturday. But softball today. Hit hard, gonna be caught by Woodruff. Stare the turn, not in time. They get the lead runner at second. Or they get the runner at second. The lead runner safe at third. Runners at first and third now with one away. Eight one lead for Perkins. Here's the pitch. Outside for a ball. That's Jordan Cox at the plate. Lady Demons at first and third. One out pitch from Stuchel. Going to be a ground ball. Going to score a run. Woodruff throws over to Zachary. There's two away. Makes it nine to one. So an RBI for Jordan Cox. Runner at first advances to second. And she is safe. Woodruff goes right to first to get the batter. Two outs. First pitch is a strike to Addie Brown, leadoff for the Lady Demons. And the 0-1 is not close inside for a ball. 1-1, one, one, two away. Here's the pitch. It's hit into left field. Lively there, dropped it. Another run's gonna come in. And another RBI here for Addie Brown. And that was a tough play in left center by Landry. She had to come up quick. She got fell down to her knees to try to catch that. And right whenever she hit the ground, the ball hit the glove and it just jarred it out. So 10 to 1 is your score here. Two away. Runner at first for Perkins Tryon. Pitches outside for a ball to Chesney Lowry. She hit a solo home run in the first for Perkins. She drives that into right field. It's going to go to the wall. One run will come in. Lowry goes to third with an RBI triple. The ball is loose in the middle in the infield, and she'll score. So that makes it 12 to 1. Perkins on top. Just got past uh, Hammond in right field and went right to the fence. The throw got loose in the infield, and everybody scored. 
pitches outside for a ball to Maddie Castle. We're in the bottom of the third. That's ball two. And Perkins try on leads Mangum 12 to one. Ranked number 11 and 5A. Ground ball right to Woodworth, catches it, throws over to Zachary, hits the dirt, dig by Hadley Good, out number three. We go to the top of the fourth. Lady Demons, a Perkins 12, Mangum 1. Lady Tigers up to bat whenever we come back here on Classic Hits 97.7. 333 Dental Care in Mangum is the dental practice of Dr. Dustin Lively. His experience, skill, and compassion go together when providing exceptional, up-to-date patient care. Dr. Lively and his team of professionals are proud to help you with the best dental care possible, along with preventive care that will result in a beautiful, long-lasting smile. Call 580-782-2552 or visit at the team at 333 Dental Care. They support the Mangum Tigers and Lady Tigers. J&P's Cafe in Mangum offers great food made fresh with the best ingredients under the direction of Chef George is what you'll find at J&P Cafe in Mangum. If you haven't tried the best Mexican food and American favorites at J&P Cafe in Mangum, what are you waiting for? Open Tuesday through Sunday for lunch and dinner. Also breakfast served all day and homemade desserts, including pecan pie and wonderful assorted cheesecakes. For takeout, call 580-706 6-5042 at 706-5042 and like J&P Cafe on Facebook. All right, Lady Tigers with some work to do as we go to the top of the fourth. They trail Perkins try on 12 to 1. It will be 6, 7, and 8 for Mangum. And the first pitch to Hadley Zachary is in there for a called strike. Zachary, Hammond, and Taylor here in the fourth. Hadley drives it. It's going to be over the outfielder's head, go to the wall. Hadley will round first base and hold up. So the leadoff single by Zachary. And she smoked it. And Cooper will run for Hadley at first. Candace Cooper is at first after the leadoff single by Zachary. And that will bring up Taylor, excuse me, Hammond. Taylor is on deck. Here's the pitch. Going to be hitting the hole. Left field base hit. The shortstop didn't knock it down late, but it was already on the grass, and so everyone's safe. First and second with nobody out. And Mangum desperately looking for some runs here in the fourth, trailing 12-1 to one to Perkins Tryon. Brings up Taylor. First pitch of ball. Again, slow pitch in the spring, fast pitch in the fall. You'll find folks that don't like it, folks that do like it. Some are just if it if it ain't fast pitch, then. But uh, it's it's a different game. It's a different game. You've got a stud pitcher, fast pitch, boy. That, Right her arm all season long. That's going to be caught in the uh, foul territory along the first base line in the outfield as Hammond, uh, excuse me, uh, Taylor flies out. The runners stay put at first and second. Slow pitch is... Will definitely test your defense and mentally because you can get down big, but you can also come back from being down big in slow pitch. First pitch to Hannah is a called strike, and it's 0 1. 
too deep. Ball one. So a one to one count, one away. Runners at first and second for Mangum. That's hit foul down the first baseline. Count goes to one and two to Hannah Stair. Mangum and Woodward this afternoon at four o'clock. We'll bring you that game here on the radio and online too. Outside ball two. So a 2 2 count to Hannah Stair. One away. Runners at first and second in the top of the fourth, down 12 to 1. Ground ball back to the pitcher. She'll step and throw over to third to get the lead runner. Nice job by the pitcher. Tater Stanley to gather herself and step to third and get the lead runner. So there's two away. Still runners at first and second. And Coach Bingham, that's going to be Rankins. There you go. Christian Rankins will hit for Mangum with two away. In the top of the fourth, runners at first and second still. Here's the pitch. Rankins, third baseman, gathers it. One pitch and one out. It's out number three. We go to the bottom of the fourth. Score still 12-1. to 1. Perkins try on on top of the Mangum Lady Tigers here in Oklahoma City on Classic Hits 97.7. Granite Drug Company would like to thank their customers for shopping local. They're proud to offer pharmacy services including immunizations, dispill personalized medication management, health and beauty products, gifts for every occasion, and the soda fountain open all day and serving lunch from 11 till 2. Remember, when you need prescriptions filled, tell your doctor Granite Drug Company. For top-notch heating and air conditioning service and installation. You can rely on Payne's Heating and Air, serving Southwest Oklahoma and North Texas from their headquarters in Mangum, Oklahoma. With years of experience and hundreds of satisfied customers, call Payne's Heating and Air Conditioning at 799-5130, 799-5130. People in Mangum are really enjoying handcrafted espresso drinks from the Soggy Llama drive through Wake up and get your caffeine infusion the way you like it starting at 5.30 in the morning on weekdays. The Llama offers a variety of refreshing cold drinks, including Italian sodas and Red Bull infusions. They're ready to please and refresh and made your way. Like the Soggy Llama Coffee Company on Facebook, open seven days a week. All right, welcome back. To Oklahoma City, Mangum Lady Tigers trailing 12-1 to 1 to the Perkins Tryon Lady Demons. We're batting now in the bottom of the fourth inning for Perkins. Four, five, and six. Ground ball will get past Woodward. And Taylor Stanley is safe at first to lead things off for the Lady Demons in the bottom of the fourth. Brings up Landry Shepard way out of the zone for a ball. 12-1 lead here for Perkins Tryon. Pretty much a top 10 team in Class 5A. Taking on 3A Mangum. Here's the pitch. One hop, Woodruff goes to stare at second. The throw to first, not in time. There's one away. They get the lead runner. Brings up Hannah Wolf. Mangum in the all-black uniforms today. Called strike. Again, 12 to 1. We've had solo home run. We've had a grand slam by Perkins. And they have executed hits and 
Ran the bases well, too. Here's pitch. Popped up, foul territory. It's going to be fair, actually. And so the runner will go from first all the way to third. I just snuck in the chalk down the uh, first base line on the grass and shallow right. So one away. Lady Demons runners at first and third. Here's the pitch. Outside for a ball. That's Jalen Cox at the plate. one -oh pitch is going to be way out of the zone. Ball two. Maya Wolf on deck. 12 to 1. Perkins Tryon on top of the Mangum Lady Tigers. Runners at first and third. Here's the pitch. And that's gone. That's a three run shot. And that cleared the fence easily. That makes it 15 to 1. And that is the ball game. So a walk-off for Perkins Tryon will end this game at 15 to 1. Lady Demons defeat the Mangum Lady Tigers. Perkins Tryon will improve to 8 and 6 on the year. Mangum will fall to 7 and 9 on this season. And our next game will be at 4 o'clock this afternoon against the Woodward Lady Boomers. Another 5 8 team. So, that wraps up our first game here from Oklahoma City. Thanks to all of our sponsors. We appreciate you and also everyone back home. Again, hopefully able to bring you some of this uh, Lady Tiger action for you. Had to work today or school. Thanks for checking in on the radio or online, Facebook or Mangum Tiger TV on YouTube as well. So, we'll end things here. We'll go get some lunch and we'll come back. And Mangum will be on the big field, the one you see on TV uh, here at Hall of Fame Stadium whenever they take on Woodward at 4 o'clock this afternoon. Also, best of luck to the Mangum Tiger baseball team as they're underway. Uh, they're participating in the Hobart Tournament today. We'll catch up with the baseball team tomorrow and on Saturday in Hobart. For all of our sponsors, I'm Chad Fox, Mangum Lady Tiger Softball on the air, Classic Hits 97.7.